everybody thank you for coming back to my channel or if you're new here my name is crystal welcome 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 today i have a really exciting video for you and i've been working really hard on it it's a planner it's called my project planner freebies project wait i think i said that wrong but anyways it's a planner made entirely out of freebies or and if it's something that it's like a divider i made it myself so i'm really and of course the planner so Basically, all you need is a planner, or you can actually use little rings, which I'm going to show you guys at the end of the video, another option for a planner instead that I got at the dollar store. But okay, so I'm so excited. I'll open her up. So ta-da! This is a Filofax planner, if anyone's wondering. It's in the Safiana leather. And so it's pretty basic at the cards up here. So these are freebies from Salty22. And they just say a little little keys then this april is a freebie from sterling inc and this is a task card that i made from just like little dot stickers and my label maker so i will list i will let you guys know how i made everything um that i made and i will also list in the description bar all the shops are all the ig accounts is mostly ig accounts and all the um supplies that i used too just in case you want know, to go back a reference so this freebie, this one's actually from me, um, from Crystal Plans. There I have all my freebies listed in the description box as well too. And then so when I, so I made this pocket. It's made out of a piece of lamination and I took two sticky pockets that I got from Amazon and I just stuck them on there and hole punched it. And then so this freebie here is a, from Rosie Papa Tree. You have to join her email list to get it. And this is another freebie from Rosie Papa Tree. And this is a freebie from Laura Jane Plants. And then this is from Ash Plants. And this is from Kika Printables. And then we just go to Ivy Mill Inc. Freebie, beautiful cloth. She's got amazing freebies. And same on the back is from her. And then here's another card pocket I made, but this time I put three card pockets down, sticky pockets, to make a little bit more of a compact looking one. So this one is from Neutral Minimal Co. And this is from Mary Grillam Planner. And this one's from Floor Peppa Tree. Then Kika Printables and Floor Peppa Tree as well. Floor Peppa Tree is the same thing as Maria Plans. I'll make sure to note that in the description box though. And then this time to relax, beautiful one is from Latua Notes. She's got a beautiful bundle, beautiful bundle of freebies. And so does Dream Seeds. And this is where this is from. So many beautiful, it's called the Romanticism Package. And yeah, no, it's gorgeous, gorgeous. And then this is from EO Edits, another one I'm sure you probably, if you've been in the planner community, you've probably even heard of EO Edits Freebies and EO Edits Shop. It's both incredible. So that's the front and the back dashboard that you printed. And then, so I made these dividers myself. And what I made them out of was um, you go to the dollar store and you get a file folder, just like a file folder. And you can, they come in all different kinds of colors, but I just chose black and I just traced the size that you need so it's 3.75 by 6.75 for a personal size and then I just kind of drew on my own little tab and I did that for all of them I kept kind of I kept them in a row so I could draw them so they're just staggering like this and then I just cut them out and hole punched them and it worked really well so yeah so make sure to kind of keep your eyes open for all kinds of materials for uses of stuff like that so this was just from the dollar store it was a file folder and so I made inboxes for a section for you guys and then this is a a section cover from Arlene Collection. I have section covers for all of the all of them in here from her, so they're beautiful. And I printed this one on vellum. This is from the Delicate Leo. It's a GTD getting things done kind of system chart. And then so the sticky pockets. Um, this one's from all the printed ones that I printed are freebies. So I made sure to print all of the ones that I printed that are freebies, but this one is from cloth and paper. So this one doesn't have any printing on it. It's just the actual sticky note. It's from cloth and paper. But this one is, I buy a pack of sticky notes from Amazon that are white for like $10. And it's a huge thick pack like this. And then I print, um, you can print sticky notes. And I'll list all the freebies that I've got too. I'm, I'm probably gonna say freebies along this video, but it's just so great. And then, so here's another idea is I took a piece of lamination and what I did is I hole punched it and I cut it a little bit above so it has an extra amount of length to it. And I put a label that says inbox and I slid it with a pair of scissors so it can pop in and out easily for a bookmark. And you can put sticky notes on this as well. Like a little like today tab, like reminiscent of the cloth and paper one. 
So the first one is from Rose and Miss, and this is an editable. I wanted to make sure I remember to tell you guys. This is editable. You can put um, whatever you want in the sections up here on your Adobe PDF, which is a free program. And this one is from Not A Notes. It's just a fold out boxes. And I love using boxes as my inbox to kind of <laughs> inbox, inbox. Huh. Anyways, so yeah, so that's from Not A Notes. This is a freebie from SM Plans. And it says inbox and then it has the lines there. So I want to give you guys a couple of different options of inbox inserts. And then here is another um, sticky pocket uh, laminated dashboard that I made with two sticky pockets from Amazon. This is card is from EO Edits. This is a piece of divider material from Avery that I cut down and made into a card size and I rounded the corners. And this is from Ivy Mill Inc. And then this beautiful one is from Life as Monica, the curated wardrobe. And so is this on the back here. Then this is from the Love Lux plan. There's no limit on ways you can bloom. And then this is a posh puppetry freebie. Love it. I printed this one on photo paper that I got from the dollar store. And this is printed on acetate that I got from Amazon. This is a freebie from Minimal Kylie. She has a bunch of coffee post-its that you can print out. They're beautiful. And then here's another, this is a large sticky pocket that I got from Amazon. The back is from Maria Plans. And then this is a freebie card from me. So that's listed in my um, uh, Google Drive. And then this is a, a um, task card that I made out of white label maker print. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'm getting so excited that like my, my brain is moving faster than my mouth can and I don't wanna be talking like 100 miles per hour for you guys. <laughs> but so my next section is lists. And then this is from Arlene Collection. And then here's another um, dashboard that I made with a sticky pocket. And then this is a task card that I made from Page Flags, um, sticky notes that I cut down and my label maker. This freebie is from Elysian. I'll make sure to type it into the um, description box. It's E-L-I-Z-N-N.com. She has beautiful freebies. So got some list ones. And then this one is from Written Treasuries. Oh, beautiful on Instagram. This is from Elysian again. So just kind of a notes grid type of style. This is a freebie from Peanuts Planner Co. Just a nice list. Peanuts Planner Co. has amazing freebies. You just gotta get on their Facebook group. And she'll you just gotta apply and then she'll approve you. And then th I wanted to put another one with a bullet point. So this is the same freebie from SM Plans, but you can use freebies for lots of different reasons. I just kind of wanted to point that out. This notes one is from Lightly Lux. Love that one, I love it so much. And so is this bomb box list from Lightly Lux. And this shopping one is from Lightly Lux as well. Shopping list. And then this uh, acetate that I printed on, that says the agenda is from Plain and White over top of uh, Maria Plans floral dashboard with here's another one of those Latua notes but this time it's printed on photo paper so you can see it a little bit better just gorgeous nothing on the back there and then I went into weeklies so Arlene collection and I wanted to get a good selection of each type of category for you guys like different types of inserts so you guys could have like a good variety to choose from so this one is from Jen B Plans. It's one of my all-time favorites. She's such a sweetheart on Instagram as well too. And this is just another um, divider that I made from um, old divider material actually. Like you can buy a pack of dividers from Walmart and you can just cut them down into any size that you want too. So they work out really well to make dividers out of as well. And they hole punch really easy and they cut really easy too. So this is a week on two page and it has your horizontal weeklies, and then a task list, little calendar, and a note spot. And then this is another great one from Papier Flirtier. <laughs> I'm definitely saying that wrong, but you know, again, I'll have it linked in the description box or type down there. And it's just a horizontal as well with two vertical boxes for Saturday and Sunday to-do list and a little note section and a spot for the year and the week number and month. This one is from Not A Notes. It's vertical weekly this time. And it goes Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. A little spot for this week's stuff to do. And it reminds me of the cloth and paper ones, which I love so much. And then here's a week on one page. This is from Alicia Sierra. 
and it has just three spots for your priority and it has your Monday to Sunday and then it tasks and then notes section. So this is a really good one if you want a week on one page. And this is from her as well too. And it just goes Monday to Sunday. So it doesn't have any of the tax stuff. It just has the horizontal Monday to Sunday. And then this one's from Lightly Lux. And it's a week on two page again. And it goes Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Extra space for maybe like next week. And then it has um, your task list and notes area over here. And then this is a beautiful um, freebie from Maria Piper, Maria Plant, sorry. Over another dashboard that I made from Floor Paper Tree is the card, both of these. And this one's from Ash Plants. This is a really cool dashboard that says Let's Do This is from the Planner Spot. And for the Planner Spot, you have to sign up to be on her email subscription list and then you'll, she'll get the password to you. And then this is from EO Edits, Planner Purge. And it's double-sided. And then we go into dailies and then so here's another one I made too and it just says today another bookmark and I put a sticky pocket on this one with a um, task card that has daily chores and stuff on it. This is my favorite probably one of my favorites freebies is from Pop and Pages Co and this one's a daily a day on one page you can see it has the task list here. Um, a morning, afternoon, evening spot to put in your plans. And you can, I usually just put the date right up here and then more notes. And then this one's from Alicia, Alicia Sierra as well, um, as well as those weeklies. So it has a calendar that, or a schedule, sorry, that goes from six to eight. And then a little priority list up here and then more lists. You can highlight the day of the week up here and then another spot to put the actual date. Here's a beautiful freebie from Jen B Plans who also made one of those weeklies. It is really nice and straightforward. It just has your tasks here today for plans. Highlight Monday to Friday, put in the date there. And then this is a freebie from Peanuts Planner Co. And it has 7 to 10 p.m. for your schedule. And then like notes over here to put in your stuff that you're doing. And yeah, pretty straightforward. And then I wanted to give you guys a, a day on two, sorry, two days on one page. So this is from a Lizanne. And it has, like I just said, two days on one page. So they're vertical style, like that. So you got your task list, you put your plans right there. And it has morning, um, day, and evening. You could put like a routine in there. And then this one I thought was really cool from Elysian. It has this right side page, it's just a journal. And it has like the little moves that you can highlight so you can journal about your day. And then it has a schedule and it goes from 5 a.m. to 9 p.m. A nice healthy to-do list three priority spot, which I love and a little spot to check off the weather, which I love checking. I love um, highlighting the weather for the day. So that's it for the dailies. And then my minimal planner freebie on acetate. And then this is from Latua Notes. It's one from, from that bundle again, beautiful. And then this is a freebie from, Mar no, sorry, Sammy. This one's from Salty22. I know that for sure. This one is from Maria Plans, yeah. And then this is from Posh Peppa Tree. Guts, Grace, and Gratitude. And then here's one from Floor Peppa Tree. And this is a little task card that I made as well from stickers and my label maker. I use my label maker for so much. Same with on here. And then we go into the monthlies. And that's kind of exciting because I have, I use the word exciting a lot too, but I've just been waiting for so long to film this video because I but I wanted to curate all of these like to ones that these are inserts that I've actually used and I actually like and just on bonuses out their freebies. So this is um, a monthly, a month on two page from, um, sorry, Peanuts Planner Co. And it's dated. So that's amazing. So here's the front cover page that you would get. And then you have your like, I only I only printed out a few months of each one just so I can give you guys an example. So here's January, February. And if she has a Monday and a Sunday start, so you can choose which one you want. And then you can go into your March. And then I, here's another bookmark that I made that says month. And then here's a monthly overview from Alicia Sierra. So you can just put in your monthly dates here and it has one to 31. So you can just like, if you want just a little snapshot of your month, this is what you can do. It has a spot for priorities and you put your month there and task and notes. And then if you guys wanted an undated month on two page, this one from SM Plans is gorgeous. So it's just pretty straightforward. It goes Monday to Sunday. 
And then you have a little, little section over here for notes. And yeah, it's completely undated. And it's got a cute little heart right there. <laughs> and then this one is from... Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Why? Planet. Planet. Okay, I'm going to have to relook it up and then put it in the description. I'm so sorry. I really, I actually studied where all of these were supposed to be from, but this one was the latest one that I added in. And it's a month on two pages and it's dated. And as you can tell, it's decorated quite nicely with a pink a um, accent. So there's like January. February, March, April, May, May, June. So what I'll do is I'll put in the description box, month on two pages, pink accent calendar, and then I'll put where it's from beside there. So sorry about that. And then this one is from Not A Note. So this is a month on one page, which is really great. So you just have your month and it's dated, and then your, where you can put in your important dates. So month on one page is really, really neat to have. And then so we come to another um, section cover that I made. This is from Kubo and Lucy. And then this card back here is from Ivy Mill Inc. This is from Maria Plants. And this is from Laura Jane Plants. And this one is from Maria Plants too. And then here we have something from Demi Rose Plants. I printed it on vellum. And then this is from Color Cafe. As so is this on the back. And then this is from Plan with DVB. It's the seven lovely logistics. So it says time heals almost everything. Give some time, some time. Make peace with your past so it doesn't spoil your present. Just really nice um reminders for life, really. This is a great freebie from Suji Plans. It's when and how often to plan. And so, so it's like start your day, give yourself 10 minutes, before bed, about 20 minutes, and it's a nice little guideline to follow. And then we have our self, oh, sorry, it's not self-care. Um, I just didn't change the label. It's actually yearlies. So Arlene Collection. This is a great freebie from Paper Test Designs. And it's a year at a glance. And it has 2023 on the front and 2024 on the back. And she does one of these every year. And they're just so aesthetically pleasing and beautiful. This one is from Maria Plans' this Holidays. And this is from... Cup and Pages Co. This year at a glance. Sorry, this is from Maria Plans as well. I just printed it on the back, so it had something back there. Then this year um, overview is from Pop and Pages Co. And it's really great. It's exactly what you need to have like in this section of the quarters. And then so that's it for our yearlies. And then we have a planning with K dashboard. I'm so sorry for what I said before I had my coffee, <laughs> which is amazing and I love it. And I love her. She's so so nice. And I was going to say sweet and nice, but she's both of those things. <laughs> this is from Floor Peppa Tree, another dashboard that I made with a Sammy Plans on the back card there. And then this is from Demi Rose Plans as well. This is from Mel Plan. And then this is from the Planner Spot, this freebie here. And this is from Minimal Kylie. So cute. And then we go to Trackers. So Arlene Collection, again, for the section cover. This is from Nada Notes. It's a monthly tracker, so it has 131. Then this is a yearly tracker, so it has 1 to 12 to track for the month. So this would be like tracking things like I got my oil changed this month, or I changed my um, coffee filter this month, or <laughs> something like something that you don't do every month or that you do every month that you want to keep track of. And then this I printed from the planner spot to be like a, a period tracker, which is what I actually use in my planner for a period tracker. So I just dot off the days that I'm um, going through my cycle. And then there's actually a mood tracker from Ivory Mill Inc. And it's amazing. And it has, so it's for the month. And she already has like different moods in here. So you don't even have to worry about it. But she also provides a blank template if you want to, write in your own moods or even you can use this for a regular tracker too it's really beautiful and then i have a gratitude little section cover here that i made this is from um neutral minimal co this beautiful card and this card back here is from paper test designs this is a freebie from dove note co so i would use this as my gratitude to write one to 31 days so just like line a day and then i kind of have like finances section 
So this is a, from Elysian too, and it's like a budget tracker. So you have like your income, your bills, your yearly stuff, and then you have your balances, and then you have your bill tracker right here that you can use, and then check off each month as it goes by. And then this is from Nada Notes. It's an expenses tracker. So you just keep track of all your purchases and whatnot that you've made. And same with this, this is an order tracker from Nada Notes. So you would just write in your details and then it has this cute little um, key down here for ordered, shipped and received. So you just check e off each one, which I love. And this Lightly Lux online purchase tracker too was just too cute not to um, put in here as well. And then we have miscellaneous. So like your vehicle maintenance, this is from Nada Notes. Your home inventory, this is from Ivy Mill Inc. A food checklist, so like um, when you buy like produce, quantity, stuff like that from Ivy Mill Inc. With note, pretty notes on the back. And then this is from Elysian, and it's a pet and vet um, tracker. So, or not tracker, sorry, a pet vet information document. So you have like your name of your animals, the birthday, spay and neutered, chip, allergies, the vet number and all that stuff. And then on the back, whoops, on the back it has, you can print a pet care log. So like date that you gave him a bath, date that you got a shot, stuff like that. And then this is from Elysian as well, and it's a reading journal and it's so great. It has a little spot where you can even draw in the cover or just write it in, title, your spot where you can rate the book, author, all that awesome stuff. Favorite quote, it's really thoughtful. And then this is a smart goals freebie from By Tezzy Plants. And it just kind of tells you how to do your goals in the smart method. <laughs> and then this is a trigger list from the planner spot for your goal setting and also a planning one on the back. And then here's a goals freebie from Squizzleberry. So you can write your goal there and then do the action steps. So it has one to five. And then on the back, it's broken down into monthlies. So you can put like your each of your monthly goals on here too. And then this is from the planner spot. It's a goals insert as well. And what you can do is you put your goal there and then you put how daily, how you're gonna accomplish your goal daily, how you're gonna help to accomplish your goal bi-weekly and how you're gonna do steps to help your goal by monthly And then you just put those in there. So you can um, refer back to them. So when you're making your schedule, oh yeah, I have to do this step if I wanna like work towards my goal. And then here's another one from Elysian and it's goals and steps. So you can put the goal in here and then you put your start date, um, due date, motivation, some steps, milestones, reflection, your victory, victory date, victory dance, <laughs> and then some pen swatches from Nada Notes, which I love. Then this beautiful dashboard is from Monthly Joy. And then here's another one that I made, but these are from Laura Jane Plants. And I just printed on the back a Heidi Planner Girl um, letter. She has like this design that you can print off a, like a letter sized piece of paper. So I printed those on the back. And then this freebie is from Crafty Brenna. It's beautiful, printed on a photo paper with the Planner Spot freebie and my animal Kylie freebie. And then this is from Life as Monica. And what I did is I laminated it. And this is from Life as Monica as well. I laminated it to be like my fly leaf back here. But on the back, it has like a self-care checklist. So I took page flags with my label maker and I wrote down like things like affirmations, natural light, warm blanket, listening music. So if I want to even take one of these and put them on a daily. So like I need to get, I need to listen to music on this day and you can schedule it in even if you wanted to. Because <laughs> it's very important, right? Self-care. But yeah, so I hope I didn't go too fast or I hope it was, everything was clear and I'll make sure to put all the stuff in the description box below. And I, this is only part one, actually. I have a part two coming up and it's gonna be freebies, but in the A5 size. So I'm super excited. Here, I'll give a little, give a little preview. So it's gonna be in the A5 size. So super excited about that. And I hope you enjoyed this. If you have any questions at all, please leave them in the, the comment section. I'll be happy to help you. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Bye guys. All right, hi guys. So I forgot to add in at the end of the video, those rings that I was talking about. So these ones I got from the dollar store as well. And they're just like these little rings that you clip open and closed like so. And what I do is you can put them around the inserts. So like, this is a different planner. But let's say, so you could have put, hold them in each one. So it, the pages still turn and keeps them all together. And then, yeah, so here, to show you the planner that we just used. <laughs> I got planners everywhere, if you can't tell. 
see, so you can just hold it in and then actually these ones will keep a really chunky planner. <laughs> But yeah, so that's just another option to use if you didn't have a planner and you wanted to try to keep it as minimal as possible. You could just use some of these. I'm not sure what they're called, to be honest, but these little rings. Yeah, okay. Thanks again. Bye, guys. Awesome.